For most people, it was a life-changing day. But for those who didn't care, well, it was time to start. Hey Chris, some letter from the school. Don't know if you want to have a quick look at it. Luckily, we were there to capitalize on it. Business was full speed ahead. See, if you fail the school's test, they can suspend you. So the ministry retests you, and if you fail that one, well, that wasn't a step anyone was willing to take. If you're anything like us, you'll do anything to adapt. Instead of trafficking in a uh, grass, our business is in pure, uncut, clean piss. Enter Principal Leland J. Bunker, ex-military and the kind of guy who won't let you forget it. Some people gotta stick up their asses, but this guy, this guy's got a Rambo knife. Chess club and their sabotage already got their first round of expulsion set up. <laughs> Assholes. How hard is it to pee and help out? I mean, I pee. Every day. <sighs> oh, oh Artem, um, are we meeting up later? Yeah, sure. Okay. How's your father? He sucks. Hmm? He wants me to join extracurriculars. I mean, I literally run a business. Or, I did at least. Hmm? Our suppliers quit on us. Suppliers? Yeah. They pussied out. 
Now me and Benji are gonna get suspended and Dan's gonna suck even more. Or we quit smoking, but that's not really an option. I see. Your father, how is he? Hi there. Uh, you're not gonna wanna stay around. It can get a little funky when I change your catheter. Oh, I'm good. Suit so yourself. I actually know where that's supposed to go. I can take it. Are you sure? Yeah, I, I don't mind. You just flush it down the toilet, right? Anything for my gam gam. Hey, Gam Gam. This is my friend Benji. Yeah, what's up, Gang Gang? It's Gam Gam. That's what I said. Gang Gang. Uh -huh. Hi. The following students to the auditorium. Nicholas Hopps, Mark Maui, Santa Maria, Serenity Darkmoon, Carmen Fantanel, Dick Francis, Caitlin Paku. <laughs> for marijuana. 
And that's not the only thing you tested positive for. Lysisopril, Nevorzak, and Minanine, Benzinin, Viagra? Viagra? You think I'm stupid? You think I don't know what's going on? Unless erectile dysfunction was some sort of trend these days, I'd have to assume that you all were 80 years old. Are you? You know, back in the Army, if somebody told a prank like that, we'd have you out. Should I expel you all? Should I? Well, you're lucky I'm in a good mood. Look, I'm giving you a chance to fess up. I need to find out who's behind this dirty urine. For those of you who step forward will not face the consequences. Huh? Any takers? Like all things good, though, it had to come to an end. So, where does that leave us? Everyone got away scot-free. Except, Benji and I faced the music. Surprisingly, Dad said he would help me figure it out. Everything has a price. Sometimes sacrifice is the price of business, and we were the sacrificial lamb. It was time to grow up, I guess, earn my keep. Focus, be more active, get a real job. Everything looks good here. Uh, we'd really love for you to join our team. Just one more thing. Everybody does it. It's a uh, company policy. And quit doing drugs. <laughs>